for this claim of the plain hyphen English hyphen language hyphen verbalization is with the ease of the communication with the conception of the people with the consideration by this claimant. For this claimant of the consideration is with the people of the conception, with the communication of the ease, with the plain hyphen English hyphen language hyphen verbalization by this claim. And what that means is right now I'm communicating to you in plain English language because that's the language most of us, most of the people I know were taught in school. And if I spoke like I just spoke, you may have trouble conceiving of what I'm saying, understanding what I'm saying, because what I just spoke was quantum language, correct sentence structure, communication, parse, syntax, grammar language. So therefore, I'm notifying the world that I'm being considerate in translating and speaking in a language that most people I know will comprehend. Just wanted to throw that out there. This video is the first video in the correct sentence structure videos uh, playlist I'm making. And it is a companion piece to another video I did in my syntax playlist, which deals with a couple sentences taken off of a government website. The first sentence is this. Donald J. Trump is the 45th president of the United States. In that syntax video, I syntax the sentence. But for our purposes here, we're just going to look at the no contract things. So we have president. P-R-E means no. That's a no contract word. E-D is past tense. It negates the now time. So that's a no contract word. So how do you say Donald Trump is the 45th president? This is how you would say it. One way to say it. This is how I say it in this now time. For this claim of the chief leader is with the Donald John Trump of the 45th position with the synthetic corporation by this claim. And I say synthetic because United States is past tense. It doesn't exist in the now time. So I'm bringing it into the now time by using this word instead. So synthetic United States Corporation. And I use the word chief leader as a positive performance word for this no contract word president. And I use what his full name would be punctuated. And these underlined words are known as compound facts or compound knowns. K-N-O-W-Ns. And backwards, it would say, for this claim of the synthetic United States Corporation is, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Backwards it would say, for this claim of the synthetic United States Corporation is with the 45th position of the Donald John Trump with the chief leader by this claim. The next sentence is, he believes the United States has incredible potential and, now in quantum, we have one thought, one claim per sentence. So this is a compound sentence on the website, so we have to break it into two parts. And the first part is this one, and we see a no contract here, we see no contract here, and no contract here. So the way we, we would have to break it down, or the way I broke it down into quantum would be, for the claim of the confidence, belief, is with the potential of the synthetic United States Corporation with this conveyance by this claimant, Donald hyphen John colon Trump. And backwards that would be, for this claimant of this conveyance is with the synthetic United States Corporation of the potential with the confidence belief 
by the claim. Or, you know, to make it more specific, you could say by this claim. And the second part of that compound sentence will go on to exceed even its remarkable achievements of the past, which basically says, we'll go on no contract, no contract, no contract, it's no contract, no contract of the past. How can we turn this into a positive performance? This is how I would do it in this now time. For the claimant's knowledge, and the claimant is this guy, because the authority comes at the bottom of his vision. Now I say his because it's peculiar, it's particular specific to him. So we use his as the lodial vision. And by vision, it's a positive performance word, meaning you're looking into the future. You have a vision of it. It's in your mind. So for the claimant's knowledge of his vision is with the marvelous performances instead of remarkable achievements no contract no contract we have marvelous performances of the synthetic united states corporation with this conveyance by this claimant donald hyphen john colon trump and backwards for this claimant of this conveyance is with the synthetic united states corporation of the marvelous performances with his vision by the claimant's knowledge, which turns it into a positive performance. And uh, that's how you would translate it into quantum, into a positive performance contract, mathematically certified frontwards and backwards. I hope you enjoyed this first uh, correct sentence structure video. Uh, sorry if it's a little bit choppy but I'm still figuring stuff out. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to join my Correct Language Performance Facebook group, please find the link to that in the description below the video, as well as feel free to contact me in the private and the confidential with any questions at the email address also in the description below the video. Thank you very much for watching.